IBD research is changing and improving the way Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis are diagnosed and treated. How are breakthroughs and research helping you today? Have you ever asked yourself, what is currently going on in research and how close are we to answers? Or how will advances in IBD genetics and immunology impact me? National expert and researcher, Dr. Stefan Targan of the University of California, Los Angeles School of Medicine, helps us understand the latest developments in IBD, which will ultimately lead us closer and closer to reaching our goals. The goals of uh, research, uh, clearly the ultimate uh, is a cure. Uh, that is so we can define exactly what the causes are, uh, because in these diseases there will be several, uh, and to obviously how to, present, to prevent those. Uh, but it, as important is to develop new and improved treatments and obviously increase the quality of patients' lives. Research is done in steps. The, the, the key is if this ladder, uh, you know, if we can tilt it down a little bit, we can get up much more quickly. Right now, uh, and we're moving very rapidly uh, in the directions that we need to go. One of the major things that have occurred in the last uh, five years or so is the unraveling of the IBD-related genetics led to the here and now, the different trials ongoing uh, that are targeting this. Just to give you a sense of this explosion of genetics, these are the IBD-related genetics in 2010. There's at least 80 different genes uh, and, uh, that have been discovered in Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis. Importance of and so unraveling the genetics, is in fact, uh, an impact on our leap forward in understanding of how these genes have gone awry. The importance of this is going to be this rapid discovery, new therapeutic targets. But understanding which manipulation of, of which bacteria in which patients are going to have the best impact. So what does this all mean? But if for each of these trials. We need 100 to 200 to 300 to 400 patients. We need as many people uh, to participate in them, what's appropriate, obviously, when you talk with your, uh, your own physician, so that we can find out all the good things that we just talked about as quickly as possible. I've been in this game a long time. I've never been as excited as I am, where we can see the end of it uh, and want to be part of it. Find out more by viewing the full presentation at www.ccfa.org forward slash info forward slash webcast.